Let's look at what really happens when it rains in Victoria. When the rain begins to fall each year, where does all that water really go? Did you know that 660 millimeters, or just over two feet of rain, falls in Victoria each year? When the rain falls in natural settings, it slowly filters through the leaves and the trees and the shrubs into the ground. When rainwater enters the soil, it's naturally cleaned and filtered on its way to the water table and surrounding waterways. This is the natural water cycle that keeps the water clean. In cities like Victoria, the natural water cycle is broken when the rain hits hard surfaces like roofs, sidewalks, and roads. The stormwater collects oils, chemicals, and other pollutants and carries them along to nearby creeks and oceans. The geography in Victoria also controls where the rainwater goes when it lands. Did you know there are five watershed areas in the city of Victoria? This shows the direction of where our water flows. If you live in the Gonzales neighborhood, this is where your stormwater enters the ocean. To prevent flooding and to ensure that the stormwater entering our oceans and creeks is clean, the stormwater system needs to be well managed. There are two ways to manage the rain that falls in our city, with pipes and drains, the traditional way, or with methods that allow nature to do its job. Rain gardens, green roofs, or permeable driveways, for example. Both of these approaches of stormwater management and rainwater management are needed in Victoria. Our current stormwater system focuses mostly on traditional infrastructure, the pipes and drains. This enormous system is mostly all underground, out of sight and almost out of mind. Did you know that there are 253 kilometers of storm drains? That, if in a straight line, would stretch all the way from Victoria to Campbell River. 5,700 catch basins that are located along the curb and collect the stormwater that goes through the grates. They also catch some of the oil, metals, sand and dirt to keep our water clean. Over 15,000 pipes that carry away stormwater from houses and businesses. Three stormwater rehabilitation units that capture more sand, oil and floating objects and 73 stormwater outlets where the stormwater flows into our creeks and ocean. Rainwater management methods include rain gardens, green roofs, bioswales, infiltration chambers, rain barrels, and cisterns. They work to slow, clean, and return rain back to the natural water table. Rainwater can also be collected with some of these methods and used as a resource in our community. You can already see examples how the City of Victoria is implementing rainwater management practices in our community like with the rain gardens at Fisherman's Wharf Park, the Spirit Garden at Centennial Square, the Trent Street Rain Garden, or along Taiyi Road at Dockside Green. At the Burnside Gorge Community Center, you can also see a new green roof. Permeable paving can be seen in areas throughout the city. Both stormwater management and rainwater management are needed in Victoria. To learn more about our stormwater system, what you can do to manage rainwater on your property and the Rainwater Rewards Program, visit victoria.ca stormwater.